हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज़ डॉक्टर उमेश आर्य फैकल्टी ऑफ मीडिया स्टडीज गुरु जम्भेश्वर यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी हिसार इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल टुडे वी वुड लर्न हाउ टू एनालाइज द डेटा इन एस पी एस एस फर्स्ट वुड गो टू एस पी एस एस एंड इट वुड ओपन लाइक दिस सो दिस इज द बेसिक यूजर इंटरफेस ऑफ एस पी एस एस लेट्स डू ए स्लाइट रिकेप ऑफ द अर्लियर ट्यूटोरियल्स लाइक दिज आर द variables this is first variable is second third fourth etc and these are the item numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and downwards so friends it is always better to learn the data analysis in media research from the two perspectives like the first one is the content analysis and the second one is the survey research so there is no basic difference between the data analysis of content analysis and the survey research but in order to learn spss data analysis in a better way we would discuss these things in isolation so i am taking content analysis first so this is one variable and this is one item number i would open a file here which is a content analysis data file okay now yeah this international publication which you are seeing right now its data is in the spss and uh the topic of the research is the coverage of different states and the union territory news in indian newspapers so we have analyzed the coverage of these states and union territories in indian english newspapers for that we have devised some of the variables like this is the first variable if you double click it then you will see first variable is the newspaper one stands for ty two stands for ht three stands for the hindu likewise second one is the category of the state news category is first is political second is crime crime news third is business and economy news fourth is sports news and so on and so forth so these are the variables in content analysis study source photos color photographs place and font styles brief news area state name so these are the variables and this is first news item like suppose if i take times of india and uh, read the front page then i would be getting some domestic news which may belong to haryana state or up state or some other state like karnataka so i would fill one here because one stands for times of india then i will see which category the add uh, the news belongs to it belongs to suppose crime category then i have given six number code to the crime category then i will see the source of that news and i will assign number two value to some particular source like api or the journalists uni pti i can give them different codes then i would see the news has the photo or not first code i have given to the yes that it has photo second code i have given to no that it does not have any photo so i would write one here because the photo exists there and if the photo is there then it should be having some color or uh, color or the black and white uh, this thing and if it is color then i would say this yeah it is 
color then I would fill it with 2 and if it is not colored then I would write it as 3 so in this way we can fill the whole attributes of the news from these variables perspective so likewise if I click downwards then I would see that I have collected around 1243 observations this is the last one it means I have collected the 1243 news items like this and I have entered the data pertaining to each variable now this data is properly formatted and it is ready for the analysis okay once this data is fed into SPSS in the number form then we would click this and it will show the labels associated with these numbers it is a toggle command it will switch over between the numbers and the text like first number I had given to the Times of India it is showing the Times of India now so the data is now ready for analysis we would run a basic descriptive analysis we would go to statistics summarize then frequencies when I click this frequency, frequencies then all these variables like newspaper, category, source, photo, colors they are present in the left window in an alphabetical order like this is alphabetical order A, B, C, D this order is different from the order of variables here so we go to newspaper first and we would take this variable on the right side of the window to be analyzed in the this is the 7.5 version of SPSS which does not have any facility of categorizing the variables according to the sequence in the SPSS data file but in the higher versions like uh, 15 or 16 then you have uh, this facility then you can either categorize them according to the alphabetical uh, order or you can categorize it according to the data files sequence so first we want to analyze the newspaper then its category and then source like all these variables we can collectively select also and put them on the right side so that analysis can be done then we would be clicking the format like we want the format in the descending counts so that the analysis is uh, easier then we would be requiring some charts for this bar charts we would be requiring this and that should be in the percentage form and then we would be clicking this continue and then ok now see what happens it is analyzing yeah it is ready like this is the frequency table it says the Hindu has got 501 news items out of 1243 and which makes the percentage of 40.3 times of India it got 392 news items and the percentage is 31.5 HD is 350 with a percentage of 28.2 like this was a numerical percentage and in order to better describe the data it has made this bar chart of the frequency of these news item uh, newspapers so see Hindu Hindu's bar is the longest it means it has got the maximum news items followed by TY and the HT so you remember that we clicked that descending counts uh, box and only that only because of that we got this 
descending sequence like the higher first higher ones the first then the second and the third now the value is missing on these bars we would double click it and then we would click these standard apply all and then and this is now it is clear that the Hindu got 40% of the share TUI got the 32% share HT got 28% share like uh, different categories of news items are there this is the table like political news they got 21.2% uh, crime got 20% others got 15% legal news got 15% and development issues related news they got 6.8% share and this makes 100 and uh, similarly the you see the result is in the descending order like the higher one and the first and lower 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 and the last so this way we can analyze the data in a better way for each variable we have the data like this so this chart we can copy it to copy objects and we can go to the MS Word and we can place it there also like yeah this is ready now we can start its interpretation Hindu got the maximum share of 40 percent followed by TOI ST etc right so friends this was the frequency analysis of the content analysis and we would close this